Typhoon Crating has unleashed a trail of destruction across the southern. Taiwan was the most powerful storm hit the island in recent memory, making landfall near the city of Koshen. The early hour of the Tuesday morning, the typhoon brought torrential rain, the violent wind, and triggered flash flooding landslides and extensive power outage. Wind gusts of over 200 km on hour approached trees, dropped tilled poles, and caused widespread destruction damage. Streets in the coastal line, including Tanyan and Pinghua, were flooded in storm surge over limits, definite inundated homes and businesses. Rescue workers were dispatched to help the white residents in low lie area where water level rose alarmingly fast. At least 15,000 were evacuated from high risk zones to government inundated emergency protocols. Shelters have been set up to school and community center, where displaced residents received fluid water and medical aid. No deaths have been reported so far, though several people have been suspended in George from the flight debris in the fallen trees. The island's disaster response team, along with the military, have been deployed to assist with the rescue operations. However, this force have been hampered by the blocks, pounding down lines and offering the weather conditions. Authority have warned that southern Taiwan could experience a few of the landslides, especially in the rural mountains area, which are particularly vulnerable or temporarily landfall. Taiwan Center Weather Bureau here issue a alert to continue have rain gusty winds warning that the typhoon was breaking it and expected to remain significant for 48 hours. Less floods are likely to present in the urban area, while rural communities are present for additional landslides. Public transport across the southern Taiwan remain heavily disrupted. Rail service between the Taipei southern cities have been suspended, with the rain station packed passengers away approved in such a mind resume. Taiwan has spread rail to critical alert to travel with the island and also partially shut down. Meanwhile, the airline was cancelled over the 115 flights, both domestic and international standard travel to the airport. Cushing, some to Taiwan's largest commercial parts have been significant disruption to shipping activities. The parts have been cancelled, uh, some the ill hour of the storm facing Kurt Wells deserted sick shelters elsewhere. The part shutdown is likely to have economic ripple effect to Kishu and Kapha for Taiwan export driving economy.